Hello guys, welcome to the Future Internet Cafe. My name is Catherine and I'll be a guide throughout today's video. So in today's video, we are going to look at how to pay online using M-Pesa Global Pay Virtual Card, where M-Pesa is not a payment option. So assuming you are buying a product or a service online on some online platform, maybe Amazon, Alibaba, or whatever platform that is, and when it comes to payment, there is only pay with card, Visa, MasterCard, but there is no M-Pesa. So what you do, you can use M-Pesa Global Pay Virtual Card. This is a partnership between M-Pesa, Safaricom, and Visa. So if um, the platform you're going to pay on, there's no M-Pesa, there's Pay With Card, there's Visa, there's MasterCard, you can click on Pay With Card or Pay With Visa, and the money will be credited or billed from your M-Pesa direct account, okay, using M-Pesa Global Pay Virtual Card. So for this example, we are going to use Netflix as an example. So go to netflix.com, enter your email address and click on get started. So Netflix is going to tell you to finish setting up your account. Click on next. Next step is creating a password. So create a password you can easily remember and enter your email address. Make sure you enter an email address that you have access to. Once you're done, click on next. So the next step is to choose a plan of your choice, then click on, so click on next. So these are the available plans that Netflix is offering, mobile, basic, standard, and premium. So choose the one you want and then click on next. This is where paying with M-Pesa Global Pay Virtual Card now comes in. As you can see, there is no pay with M-Pesa. M-Pesa is not a payment option. So there is only credit or debit card, Visa, and MasterCard. So you click on Visa. If you don't know how to set up your M-Pesa Global Pay Virtual Card, you can watch our short on how to do that. The link is in the description. So click on Visa. Okay, so open your M-Pesa app and go to Global Pay and click on See Card Details. This, those are the details that you're going to come and enter here. So enter your card number, expiration date, CVV, and the name on the card. This is the name on the card as it appears on your M-Pesa or M-Pesa Global Pay Virtual Card. Please note that M-Pesa won't ask you for a PIN. The transaction will just be automated because you, you have already set up the Global Pay Virtual Card on your M-Pesa app. So enter the M-Pesa, the Global Pay Virtual Card details here and then click on Agree and then click on Start Membership and the money will be credited from your M-Pesa direct. Money has been credited to Netflix. Congratulations, you are now a Netflix member. So enter your phone number for additional security and whatnot, and then click on Next. So Netflix is going to ask you which devices you are going to use to watch on. Choose the ones you'll be using and then click on Next. Um, enter your members and profiles names. Maybe it's for your family, your friends whoever just enter their names and then click on next choose the languages that you be watching movies and shows with on netflix and click on next so netflix is going to ask you to select three things you like three shows movies whatever so that it can give you recommendations pick the three you want or as many as you want and then click on continue and congratulations, you're now a Netflix member and you know how to pay online using M-Pesa Global Pay Virtual Card, where M-Pesa is not a payment option. Please note that this applies to all online platforms which you might need to pay with for, for money that is on your M-Pesa, including Amazon and other online platforms. So assuming that you want to buy a service or a product online and M-Pesa is not a payment option, but it's Visa or Card or uh, visa or card that is uh, so you just choose visa or pay with card and enter your M-Pesa global pay virtual card details and the money will be credited or will be billed from your M-Pesa account direct thank you so much for watching until next time bye bye